In the vast world of automobiles, there are some that stand out for their innovation, uniqueness, or downright eccentricity. The following list of five most unusual cars showcases a variety of models that have made a lasting impression in the automotive world, despite their unconventional designs or features. Join us as we explore these fascinating vehicles, each with its own story and quirks. Number 1. BMW Isetta the BMW Isetta, often referred to as the bubble car, is an iconic microcar that made its debut in the 1950s. Designed by the Italian company ESO, the Isetta was licensed to various manufacturers, including BMW, who produced it from 1955 to 1962. This little car is considered one of the most successful microcars in history, having sold over 160,000 units during its production run. The Isetta's distinctive design is characterized by its tiny size, egg-shaped body, and front opening door, which allowed passengers to enter and exit the vehicle directly from the front. The single door also incorporated the steering wheel and instrument panel, which would swing out with the door when opened, making ingress and egress a unique experience. Measuring just 7.5 feet in length and 4.5 feet in width, the Assetta had a minuscule footprint, making it perfect for navigating tight urban spaces. Under the hood, the Isetta was powered by a small 236cc single-cylinder engine that produced a modest 13 horsepower. The car's lightweight construction allowed it to reach a top speed of around 53 miles per hour, which was considered adequate for city driving at the time. The Isetta's fuel efficiency was another selling point, with reports of up to 78 miles per gallon making it an economical choice for budget-conscious motorists. Despite its small size, the Isetta had a surprising amount of interior space, with seating for two adults and some luggage. The bench seat was positioned to the rear of the vehicle, and passengers sat in a tandem arrangement with the passenger slightly behind the driver. This setup enabled the Isetta to maintain its narrow width and improve its stability during turns. The BMW Isetta played a significant role in the post. World War II era, as it provided an affordable and practical means of transportation for a recovering Europe. Its quirky design, fuel efficiency, and maneuverability made it a popular choice among city dwellers and those seeking a unique driving experience. Although production ceased in the early 1960s, the Isetta's legacy as one of the most unusual cars in the world endures, with collectors and enthusiasts cherishing this charming piece of automotive history. Number 2 1942 OEUF Electric. The 1942 OEUF Electric, also known as the Electric Egg, stands as a testament to early innovation in electric vehicles. The car was designed by Paul Arzons, a French industrial designer and artist who had a keen interest in creating unique, energy efficient vehicles. His creation, the OEUF Electric, was a minimalist and lightweight electric car that was years ahead of its time. The OEUF Electric was a three-wheeled vehicle with an egg-shaped aluminum body lending to its distinctive name. Its design was unconventional, to say the least. The front of the car featured a large curved windshield, offering excellent visibility, while the back was characterized by an open-air design, providing a unique driving experience. The body was also extremely light, weighing in at just 60 kilograms, which contributed to its energy efficiency. The car was powered by a 72-volt electric motor that drove the single rear wheel. Arzens utilized rechargeable batteries to power the OEUF, which were custom-made and could cover a range of 60 miles on a full charge. Although the top speed was a modest 44 miles per hour, this was acceptable for the primarily urban use that Arzens envisioned for the vehicle. The OEUF Electric was more of a personal project for Arzens, and was never mass-produced. However, it remains an important part of automobile history, as it was one of the earliest examples of a functional, electric-powered vehicle. The concept of the OEUF Electric, with its focus on energy efficiency and compact urban mobility, was a precursor to many modern electric vehicles. Number 3. Peel P50 The Peel P50 is a small, three-wheeled car originally manufactured from 1962 to 1965 by the Peel Engineering Company on the Isle of Man. It holds the record as the smallest production car ever made, a fact recognized by the Guinness World Records. The P50 was designed to seat one person, along with a small amount of shopping or luggage. Its extremely compact dimensions, measuring only 54 inches in length and 39 inches in width, allowed for unparalleled ease of parking and maneuvering in crowded urban spaces. 
It was advertised as being capable of seating one adult and a shopping bag. The car was powered by a 49cc two-stroke single-cylinder engine, producing a meager 4.2 horsepower. The engine was linked to a three-speed manual transmission that didn't have a reverse gear. Instead, if the driver needed to reverse, they would have to get out of the car and manually push it. Although the P-50 had a modest top speed of 38 miles per hour, it was highly fuel efficient, reportedly achieving up to 100 miles per gallon. The Peel P-50's minimalistic approach to transportation, with its small size, fuel efficiency, and straightforward design, has earned it a spot in the annals of automotive oddities. Despite its rarity, the P-50 has seen a resurgence in popularity in recent years, with a limited production run of replicas made available for enthusiasts who appreciate this unusual piece of automotive history. Number 4. Stout Scarab The Stout Scarab is often considered the world's first production minivan, debuting in the 1930s and offering a unique blend of style and functionality. The man behind this innovative vehicle was William B. Stout, a renowned engineer and inventor who made significant contributions to both the automotive and aviation industries. The Stout Scarab's design was heavily influenced by the streamlined Art Deco style popular during the period. Its body was elongated, rounded, and devoid of running boards or separate fenders, distinguishing it from other cars of the era. The Scarab was designed to maximize interior space, offering a flexible and spacious cabin that was revolutionary for its time. The rear seating could be rearranged into various configurations, including a mobile office or a cozy lounge, while the driver's seat was positioned over the front wheels to provide an excellent field of view. Underneath its unique exterior, the Stout Scarab was powered by a Ford 58 engine located in the rear of the vehicle. Its rear engine setup, which was quite unusual for the time, contributed to the vehicle's spacious interior and balanced weight distribution. The Stout Scarab also featured an innovative suspension system designed for comfort, utilizing coil springs and independent suspension on all four wheels, a rarity in the 1930s. It provided a smooth ride, further adding to the car's luxury appeal. Finally, number 5. 1955 Chrysler Ghia Streamline X Gilda the 1955 Chrysler Ghia Streamline X Gilda is a one-of-a-kind concept car that exemplifies the futuristic design ethos of the mid-20th century. The car was a collaborative project between Chrysler and the Italian design house Ghia, with styling by Giovanni Savanuzzi, a leading figure in automotive design. The Gilda's design was heavily influenced by the emerging jet age, drawing inspiration from rocket ships and aviation. Its sleek, streamlined body, characterized by its dramatic fins and low-slung profile, gave it a distinctively futuristic appearance. The car was painted in a bright metallic gold color, further enhancing its eye-catching aesthetic. The Gilda was powered by a gas turbine engine, a rarity for automobiles even today. This engine choice was in line with the car's jet age theme, as gas turbines were predominantly used in jet aircraft at the time. However, the gas turbine was not installed until the 1960s, and the car was initially displayed as a non-running model. Despite being a concept car, the Gilda was fully functional and was occasionally driven at events. Its top speed was reported to be over 140 miles per hour. Quite impressive for a car from this era. The Gilda's unique design and engineering make it a standout in automotive history, a shining example of the era's fascination with speed, aerodynamics, and the future. The Chrysler Ghia Streamline X, Gilda, remains a highly prized piece of automotive history, capturing the spirit of innovation and design exploration that characterized the 1950s.